back today and I'm going to be doing 50 things about me tag and I saw a lot of the girls on here did it and it looked really fun so I just wanted to join in on that. So I'm just going to get started but before I do let me just talk about quickly what I'm wearing. This top is from Zara and I think I did show it in one of my hauls and it's just like a like a almost I don't know bohemian type lacy top and it's kind of short. Um, it stops like a little bit below my belly button so um, yeah, it's not like a really long shirt, and I really like it a lot. And then the lighting in here is really bad, but these are just some of my bracelets that I wear, and some new ones that are coming out, and things. Uh, that stone's kind of funny, but the flawless diamond and the La Argent, because I got in trouble for saying La Argent or whatever. It's, I know how to say it. it's La Argent, but I didn't want to. I don't know. I just feel funny like really pronouncing words sometimes. <laughs> I don't know why, but these are both available. On my store and then um, my nails I get my nails done almost once a week because it's just like almost like a relaxation thing for me and I just like it a lot so these are my nails and um, some of them are white and sparkly some of them are teal and sparkly some of them are baby blue and they're just fun and pretty I'm not wearing my engagement ring right now so no one freak out about that I was just actually spraying Windex on it and I forgot it on the counter doesn't mean that I'm not engaged. I know that that would be like the first thing someone would write. Um, hair is just honestly like it just bl I just it just dried. Like I got out of the shower this morning and this is how it start it like landed and I just kind of like uh, blew out blew dry my bangs. I'm not wearing anything on my lips. Uh, chapstick and then I have, my face is really minimal. It's just that Stila. Um, cheeks and some black mascara and black eyeliner and that's it. My least favorite food is green beans. I'm very traditional. This is a funny one but I would love to have Asian girlfriends but I just never have had any. I don't know why. Like really close ones I mean. I love for the inside of my purse to be filled with like pretty girly things and have it be really bright but typically all of my bags are very not bright. I recently got engaged. My pet rabbit Bao is named after a Baozi. It's a steamed Chinese bun and he looks just like that when he's all curled up and sitting down. So that's why I named him that. I'm 29 years old. I just turned 29 in May. I believe in the philosophy quality over quantity. I was born deaf in my left ear. My mom is my very best friend. I'm half Swedish and half Greek. I have a weird thing about my sheets and my towels having to be white. I can be a control freak. I definitely believe in courtship and gender roles. This is weird, but my favorite actor is W.C. Fields. I really am not into like the whole Hollywood scene and I'm, I don't know, I don't have like a recent favorite actor. My, so yeah, my all time favorite actor is W.C. Fields. As you guys probably know, I'm obsessed with Bao, my pet rabbit, and I even have a stroller for him. When I was in high school, I had very, very few friends. I don't like to drink juice unless it's fresh squeezed. This is so weird, but for those of you living on the west coast of the United States, you might know this restaurant, but my favorite restaurant, and it sounds so funny, is El Torito. <laughs> for my undergrad, I majored in political science. I lived in Shanghai for a year while I was interning um, and getting my master's. I always have to have extra, extra ice when I'm drinking soda. I'm not the kind of girl who ever had a ton of friends, but I have a few close friends. I can't stand writing with pens that are thicker than 0.5 ink. I competed in two world championships for karate in Tokyo and in Texas. I'm obsessed with really cute animals and really strong coffee. I'm a very good swimmer. My favorite colors are black and white. I'm almost crazy particular when it comes to my writing when I'm writing lists or when I'm writing in my planner. I'm definitely a procrastinator, but I always feel like I turn out my best work when it's almost late. I love pops of color, whether it's in my dress or in my home. If I don't have coffee, I cannot wake up. I can hardly do simple math like adding and subtracting, but my first job out of school was in accounting. I speak Greek almost fluently. I drink an iced coffee with an extra shot of espresso and a little bit of half and half every single day from Starbucks. I'm a Taurus and I definitely am a Taurus. Sometimes I wish I wasn't so opinionated, it gets tiring. It's not supposed to sound offensive or anything 
at all because I love Asian people, but sometimes I feel like I was meant to be born Asian. <laughs> People always tell me that though, so I don't think that's offensive at all. I really cannot stand nightclubs. I'm a huge sucker for any new gadget that came out. And any like accessories for gadgets or like charms for gadgets, anything like that. I speak conversational Mandarin. Ni hao! I used to be severely, almost severely overweight. Uh, at my highest, I reached 181 pounds, and I was a freshman in college at the time. Um, I kind of buckled down and lost a bunch of the weight when, in like, I guess junior year of college, and I've kept it off pretty much ever since then. My favorite, favorite, favorite spot to vacation is Honolulu. I have a master's in international business. My guilty pleasure food is um, a Caesar salad from Cheesecake Factory with a side of french fries. I practiced traditional Japanese karate for 15 years. I was baptized Greek Orthodox. I'm mostly influenced by different cultures and people, different countries, places, things like that. I work better in the afternoon or night. I am so not a morning person when it comes to working. I can get up, but I just cannot work or be effective in the morning. It has to be like around 2 or 3 o'clock. I love the 1920s. So I hope that was 50. I'm pretty sure it was 50, but like I said in the video, I cannot add. So if I'm like off one, I would not be surprised. <sighs> okay, <laughs> it's true. So thank you so much for watching. I hope this kind of like told you guys a few cool things about me if you ever wondered. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching. Bye.